Hey, what's up YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, your favorite Pennsylvanian reviewer. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we got ourselves some Marvel goodness. I love Marvel figures. And this was a set I got for Christmas, and these are 12-inch figures. We got some of my favorites here, like Spider-Man. <laughs> Sorry we're not looking at the packaging first, but given the figures are all up in front of the packaging, we'll look at each figure and their posability. Spider-Man's leg can kick out that far. Same with the other leg, does not have any backward movement. We can totally get him doing the the spider split. <laughs> get it? It's a joke. <laughs> Cause these figures don't have any elbow articulation. Head is on a ball joint, a tight ball joint, if I do say so myself. And there we got the first figure's articulation covered. Next we have is... We have ourselves another Star-Lord. And this one comes with his blaster. So you can go pew-pew, bang-bang, pew-pew, bang-bang. And his arms can move out that far. No elbow, elbow joints. Sorry if I have to correct myself. No elbows. His legs can kick out that far. Same with the other one. His head is on a really good ball joint. I love that. And this is a re-release of the Endgame Marvel Legends figures. Next on the list we have Captain America. And he's got his shield. So you can go smack, smack with the shield. Punch, punch. Smack, smack. <laughs> That's literally how he rolls in the Marvel comics. He can smack you with the shield. <laughs> Next on the list of 12-inch Marvels, we got the Incredible Hulk. And Hulk's... He smashes you. He smashes, smash, smash. Sorry if I can't help but add commentary. I'm explaining how these characters work in the Marvel Universe. And his head is on a ball joint compared to my other Hulk from Dollar General. Next on the list is... You guessed it, Black Widow. And this one is really well painted, really well sculpted, these figures are. She can kick out that far, she can slap, punch you. She can kick with the other leg, punch you, pow, pow. And it's what that figure does. Next we got my boy, Iron Man. So we can hit you with a repulsor blast. Hit you with an iron punch. Bang, bang. With the punch. And Unibeam you if you want him to. His arms are really well articulated. Except for the elbows. Legs can kick out that far. And that's all there is to say for the figures. Now we're going to look at the packaging on this box. And this one is pretty big. I might have to keep this box. Because look at all this artwork. Star-Lord, Spider-Man, Captain America, Marvel, Titan Heroes, Hulk on the packaging, nice artwork of Black Widow, too, and Iron Man. I am totally keeping this box. We're going to look at the back. Even more artwork. This box is worth keeping. That's all there is to say for the packaging. Probably wondering, where did I get these figures from? Well, 
I got these for Christmas. And this set cost around 50 bucks from where they got it from. 50 bucks. Would I recommend this set if you're a Marvel enthusiast like I am? Definitely. You can find this set. You won't be missing out on some good Marvel figures. And that's all there is to say for this video. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.